Atlanta, Georgia, home of Martin Luther King Jr., our middle school, and the world's busiest airport, Hartsfield Jackson International. Unfortunately, Hartsfield Jackson has become a hub for human trafficking, which is defined by the U.S. Department of Homeland Security as the use of force, fraud, or coercion to obtain some type of labor or commercial sex act. For the Samsung Solve for Tomorrow contest, we've been challenged to show how STEM can be applied to help improve our community. Given the size and severity of such a terrible problem, our team chose to combat human trafficking at our local airport. To learn more about this problem, we met with Alia El-Sawi, who is the Victim Assistance Specialist for Homeland Security Investigations. What we learned was shocking. Monthly, countless people become victims in the vicious cycle of human trafficking. In Georgia, on average, 374 women are trafficked per month. In the metro Atlanta area, around 7,200 men exploit trafficked women per month. To fight back, we plan on designing, building, and installing a dispenser in airplane bathrooms that releases an RFID tracker chip in the form of an adhesive that victims can affix their skin inconspicuously. The dispenser will also trigger a sign and alarm, alerting the flight crew that there is a victim on board. When the victim exits the plane, they will walk their readers at the gates, which will silently alert security, who can then question the victim in a safe location. For help with the design process, we teamed up with GTRI to learn more about RFIDs and wearable technology. After an iterative design process, we engineered a 12 by 6 by 3 inch stainless steel container that houses passive RFID tracking chips and a silent alarm. Pushing and twisting the knob located on the bottom of the device will release the tracker and trigger the silent alarm, letting the flight crew know that there is a victim on board. Upon exiting the plane, strategically placed RFID readers will track the adhered tags and alert security of the victim's current location. To spread the word about our device, we will install pamphlets around the airport and in the seat back pockets in each airplane, explaining where to find our device and how to use it. It also instructs individuals to look for a blue heart, which is the international symbol for human trafficking. Turning our design into a prototype proved to be quite the challenge. Fortunately, a couple of folks at Georgia Tech reached out to help with the 3D rendering of our device. Let's take a closer look at our design. Located on the dispenser will be instructions on how to obtain the device, what it does, and other important information. These instructions will be in multiple languages including braille and including pictures depicting how to use the material. With our innovation for human trafficking at Hartsfield Jackson, we can positively affect our community and protect individuals. Our device and precautions will ensure that as many people as possible can travel safely through the airport. As our video concludes, we would like to thank everyone who helped us design this solution. Hopefully, if this technology proves to be successful, we can expand it around the world.